Hello everyone and thank you for tuning in again to another episode of CivilianTacticalWeapons.com. Today's episode is actually going to be a safety episode. Um, I'm actually going to cover the best uh, insurance company, insurance policy that any gun owner could have for uh, under $30. Uh, and that's actually a product called Cellex. Um, you can get uh, different brands. Um, this one here I happen to pick up. It's actually by Sam Medical Products. And uh, Cellox is actually a um, it's a blood clotting agent. So um, a lot of times this is treated for uh, people. Some people may have, uh, if you're a hemophiliac or whatever, you may have some form of a uh, um, type of blood clotting agent that you use in case you get a cut. This is actually designed, uh, a lot of times used by the military also. And it's a very simple product to use. So if you have one, uh, if you own a firearm in your house, I would actually strongly encourage you to get some form of an agent like this. It doesn't have to be this exact one, but mainly if you think about uh, how you normally would handle um, a gunshot wound, you would go ahead and blot away any excess blood, um, try to put some pressure on it to uh, um, you know, stop yourself from having extensive bleeding, and then uh, you know, uh, hopefully get to medical attention as soon as possible from uh, you know, calling a 911 or some form like that. The problem is uh, you can still lose an excess amount of blood, especially if you're by yourself, this may be very difficult to do. So Cellox is actually a good option if uh, anyone has a gun in their house, if you're planning on um, using a, uh, a gun for self-defense, um, you should actually keep a product like this in your house. So what this, it's very simple to do. Um, you would go ahead and clot uh, you, the same process you would take for dealing with a normal gunshot wound um, is you would uh, clot away the blood that's there. Um, and instead of pu putting a compress directly on at that point, you would actually pull the compress off and pour this directly into the wound. Um, it's actually a powdered cons uh, compound. You pour this into the wound, um, pretty much empty the pack, uh, the pack into the wound. You'll probably spill some all over the place, but uh, trust me, uh, if, you're, if you're pretty much uh, got a gunshot wound, you'd care less about what uh, powder you leave around on your floor. Afterwards, you'd go ahead and apply direct pressure onto it. Um, so you'd apply direct pressure for five minutes. And the reason why you want it for at least five minutes direct pressure is this takes anywhere from two to three minutes to clot the blood. So the nice thing about this is uh, if you had a gunshot wound in your arm or your leg, um, wherever, you would go ahead and pour this onto the wound and then be able to, it would actually help clot the wound so you would actually, you know, um, not lose so much blood that you'd go unconscious. Um, of course, after you plot, clot the wound, you want to go ahead and put some form of a, a restrictive um, bandage or something to maintain pressure on the wound, and then make sure that you actually hand this packet or whatever packet you're using uh, to the medical professional who actually comes and treats you so they understand what's been used um, to treat you. But uh, this runs pretty much, I think the list price on this stuff is like $29.99. Uh, this is called Cellox, C-E-L-O-X. Um, by Sam Medical Products, um, their website, sammedical.com. And uh, you don't need any, uh, there's no heat generated in use of this, so it's not like you have to worry about, uh, uh, you know, it's not like watching a Rambo movie or something where they're burning a wound or anything. Um, it doesn't generate any heat. Um, and it's just designed to, to clot blood and clot blood very quickly. So it's great for using for severe bleeding. I keep two of these in my house. Um, there's one actually kept uh, next to my gun closet. And the other one is actually kept in the uh, is actually kept in the in the uh, kitchen along with all the other medical supplies. So um, I'd encourage you to have a couple of these packs around. Um, if anything happens, um, you know the other things too is you know forget about gunshot wound. Maybe have a really bad uh, accident in the kitchen or whatever. Um, this is actually a really good product to have around. So um, I know that's not. Uh, not a, you know, a fancy gun or anything, but I did want to cover this because I do feel it's very important, especially for a lot of people who are maybe being first-time gun owners. Um, there's a lot of stuff you can buy for gun safety devices, trigger locks, all this other stuff. When it really comes down to it, um, if you have to deploy the gun itself, um, someone's going to get shot. Um, plain and simple, someone will break in your house. Uh, you can make your own personal decision if you're going to provide medical treatment to the person who has broken into your house, that's your own personal choice. Um, but uh, if I actually get injured in the in, in, in type, that type of a scuffle, or if I have to deploy deadly force to protect myself or the people in my home, um, I actually would provide medical attention to that person. So, that being said, 
If you have any questions, please email me at info at civiliantacticalweapons.com. And uh, if you have any questions, please email me there. I do not respond to anything on YouTube. Um, also remember there are the forums on the website on civiliantacticalweapons.com. A lot of you have made comments of not being able to you know, make comments on my videos through YouTube. Um, all those comments are actually held for the website itself. Um, I've had so much problems with uh, YouTube and people, uh, anti-gun people writing comments and stuff. All of my uh, forums are controlled through the civiliantacticalweapons.com. Free forum to join and uh, hope to see you next week.